we want to make sure the rib cage stays connected to the front here so it's all like it's knit together and then the ribs are connected to the hips in the front and the back. Next, shoulder position. We want the shoulders down away from the ears instead of elevated up into the ears. So shoulders come down, we engage the lats, the middle and lower trapezius at the same time as keeping the ribs connected to the front and the back of the hips and then of course lifting the pelvic floor to scoop. The last alignment essential is the neck position. The back of the neck is lengthened as we tuck the chin just slightly. So we feel like we're getting longer and taller through our spine. And we bring all of that together with our breathing. All right, so I will cue the breathing as we do this. We start with the scoop, the ribs, the shoulders, and the neck alignment. Let's begin with our alignment movements, or our warm-ups. So start by lying on your back, feet on the floor, Imprint your rib cage to the floor. Abs are pulled in, so you're scooped. Shoulders down. Lift one knee to tabletop. Hold right here, keep your abdominals engaged, and lift the other knee to tabletop. Now stay here, inhale once. As you exhale, lower one foot to the floor without moving anything. Inhale, stay there. Exhale, lower the other foot to the floor. Inhale again, imprint your rib cage. As you exhale, lift one knee to tabletop. Inhale, chin is tucked. Exhale, lift the other knee to tabletop, once again, without moving anything. Maintaining the scoop and maintaining the ribcage position. Exhale, roll one foot back to the floor. Notice how all of this stays stable. Inhale, stay there. Exhale, lower the other foot. Let's do that again. Inhale. Exhale, lift one foot off the floor, maintaining your scoop. Inhale, hold. Exhale, lift the other foot off the floor. Inhale, stay right there. Exhale, lower one foot to the floor, keeping your scoop. Inhale, stay, and then exhale, lower the foot to the floor. I'm lifting my arms so you can see my back. Inhale, lift your spine to what you think neutral is. Just a little space between your back and the floor while maintaining your scoop. As you exhale, imprint your ribs or your lumbar spine if you have no back issues. Inhale, lift up your lower back. Exhale, use your abdominals to flatten your back, flatten the abdominals. Now, if you find yourself squeezing your butt, lift your knees up to tabletop and do the exact same thing. Inhale, lift up your lower back, and then exhale, lower your back or your rib cage. You want to get only the ribs if you have lower back issues. Inhale, lift up your back, exhale, lower your back. Two more times. Inhale, lift up your back, and exhale, lower your back. And one more time. Inhale, flatten the abdominals, and exhale, lower the back. Place the feet back on the floor. A little bit of bridging. So spread your toes out. Make sure your feet are hip width apart, or even sit bones distance better. Spread your toes out. Inhale, scoop. As you exhale, squeeze your butt, roll your hips up one vertebrae at a time. At the top, try to create a straight line from your knees to your hips to your rib cage. Inhale, stay there, chin is tucked. Exhale, roll down ribs, lower back, sacrum, and then your glutes come down last. Inhale, release your glutes, but keep your scoop. As you exhale, peel your hips and your lumbar spine off the floor. Spread your toes out. Inhale, reach your fingertips toward your heels, palms down, chin tucked. And exhale, roll down the ribs, then lumbar spine, then your sacrum, then your lower back and your butt. Good. Inhale, stay at the bottom. Exhale, roll your hips up one vertebrae at a time. As you roll up, make sure you've got weight on the heels, the big toes, and the pinky toes. Inhale, stay there, spread your toes out. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. Let's do that two more times. Inhale at the bottom, scoop, ribs connected. Exhale, roll yourself up. And don't forget, take an extra breath anytime you need to. Inhale, stay here. Pubic bone a little higher than your navel. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. And your last one. Inhale at the bottom, spread your toes out, chin is tucked. Exhale, first engage your glutes, lift your tailbone, then your sacrum. Roll up to create a straight line from your knees to your hips, to your ribs. Inhale, stay there. Breathe into your back, and exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. Take your arms up to the ceiling, palms facing each other. As you inhale, Protract your scapula, meaning just lift your shoulder blades off the floor while keeping your chin tucked. Exhale, lower your shoulder blades to the floor. Let's do that again. Inhale, lift your shoulder blades. Feel your shoulders rounding. Shoulders stay away from the ears. Exhale, lower your shoulder blades to the floor. Inhale, round your shoulders. Exhale, lower your shoulders. Two more times. Inhale, lift your shoulders. Palms face each other. Exhale, lower your shoulders. And one more time. Inhale, lift your shoulders. And exhale, lower your shoulders back to the floor. Place your palms down the floor next to your body. Inhale, elevate your shoulders like you're shrugging. 
Exhale, you lower the shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, you lift your shoulders, keep your fingers and your thumbs connected to each other. Exhale, you lower the shoulders away from the ears and feel your shoulder blades moving down towards your hips. Inhale, shrug your shoulders, keep your scoop. Exhale, lower your shoulders away from the ears. And one more time, inhale, slide your shoulders up, arms stay down, feel your shoulder blades sliding up, and exhale, slide your shoulder blades down towards your hips. Palms are staying on the floor. Raise your arms up to the ceiling as you inhale. Try to reach your arms back as far as you can go without your ribs lifting off the floor. And then exhale, bring your hands back up to the ceiling and place your palms down on the floor. Again, inhale, reach your thumbs back toward the floor. Keep the ribs connected. Chin is tucked, shoulders away from the ears. And then exhale, place your hands back on the floor. One more time, inhale, raise your arms over your head. Scooping, flatten your abdominals. And then exhale, place your palms on the floor. Now let's get ready for 100 with an ab scroll. As you inhale, tuck your chin. Exhale, lift your head, lift your shoulders, reach your arms and your fingers towards your ankles. Now as we come up, the goal is to keep the abdominals flat. Inhale, stay right here. Exhale, lower your hands, your arms, your shoulders, your head back to the floor. Inhale, scoop. Exhale, tuck your chin, roll yourself up, shoulders, and then your arms, engaging your lats, flattening the abdominals below the navel. We all want flat abdominals. Good. Inhale, stay here. Breathe into your back. Of course, not into your belly. Exhale, lower your hands, your shoulders, your head to the floor. Let's do that again two more times. Inhale, flatten your abdominals. Exhale, tuck your chin and roll yourself up. Now, if your neck starts to bother you, feel free to take a hand behind your head. Inhale, stay here. Keep your ass flat. Exhale, lower your hands, your elbows, your shoulders, your head to the floor. One more time, inhale, scoop before you begin. Exhale, tuck your chin, lift your head, your shoulders, your arms, engage your lats. Stay here, inhale. Now for more challenge, as you exhale, lift your knees to tabletop. Close your legs, inhale, stay here. And exhale, lower your hands, your shoulders, your head to the floor. Let's do that two more times with the knees to tabletop. Inhale, scoop. Exhale, roll up. Reach your arms out rather than up. Look at your body. Inhale, stay. Exhale, lower your hands, your shoulders, your head to the floor. And one more time, inhale, flatten your abdominals. Exhale, roll yourself up, reach through your fingertips, fingers together. Inhale, stay there, breathe into your back. And exhale, lower your hands, your shoulders, your head to the floor. And get ready for the workout. Our first movement is 100. 100 engages the abdominals, engages the lats. We move the arms independently of everything else. We move the arms six to eight inches, so it's a pretty big movement, to warm the body up for everything else that's coming. Options with your legs. Feet can be down for the least amount of challenge. Knees can stay at tabletop, or we can extend the legs to the ceiling for more, more intensity. And as our body is up, the legs come, can come lower. Now, as we take the legs lower, we wanna make sure that we only take the legs so low as we're able to keep our scoop, so the abs flat, and our rib cage imprinted on the floor. Good? All right, so let's get started. Start with an inhale, prepare. Exhale, tuck your chin, roll yourself up, reach your arms up, and reach your legs out, flattening your abdominals. Legs together. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, reach through the fingertips, and exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, through your nose, and exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, squeeze your legs together tighter. And exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, see if you can lower your legs lower. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, breathing again. In through your nose, exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, squeeze your legs together tighter. One more time. In through your nose. And exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, bring the knees back in and lower your shoulders as you exhale. Roll yourself up. Now, I'm not sure that was quite 100, but we were very close. Sit up as tall as you can for a half row back. Arms reach out, and we'll do some little variations here. Inhale, sit up as tall as you can. As you exhale, sink back into a C curve, meaning you're rounded from your tail, tailbone all the way to your neck. Inhale, stay here. As you exhale, maintain your C curve and hinge at the hip so you're looking for it stretching your lower back. Inhale, extend your spine, sit all the way up. Exhale, sink back again. Shoulders are down. Pretend you're pushing down into something to engage your lats. Inhale, stay here, breathe into your back, and keep the abdominals flat, scooped. Exhale, round forward, look at your navel. Inhale, sit up as tall as you can, lengthen 
front of your spine. Exhale, sink back into your C curve again. C can go back a little bit deeper while your toes remain on the floor. Inhale, stay here. Exhale, hinge at your hip, pull your abs into your spine. Inhale, sit up as tall as you can. Two more times. Exhale, sink back. Squeeze your knees together. Inhale, stay there. Flatten your abdominals to scoop. Exhale, hinge forward at the hip, keeping the C curve. Inhale, sit all the way up. Left out on variation. Exhale, sink back into your C curve. Inhale, stay here. As you exhale, open the palm closest to me and reach your arm behind you while maintaining your C curve and the same angle at your hip. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, reach the other arm back. Look at your hand as that arm reaches behind you. Inhale, come back to center. Same thing, first side. Exhale, rotate, keeping your scoop, toes remain on the floor. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, rotate, you should feel your obliques. Inhale, center, two more times. Exhale, shoulders down, ribs connected. Inhale, come back to center. Last one, exhale, rotate. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, flex forward over your hips. Inhale, stay here for one breath. And exhale, roll yourself all the way up until your spine is vertical. Rolling like a ball. Bring your feet into your body. Hands can be behind the knees for the least amount of challenge. For more challenge, your hands will come down your legs. Arms are long, feet are pulled in tightly to your hips, and you're looking at your navel. Maintain the same space between your knees and your head, and your feet and your butt as you roll back. Inhale, roll back only on your shoulders. Exhale, roll up, try to balance and stay in your seat curve. Inhale, roll back on the shoulders, stay there for just a moment. Exhale, roll all the way up, shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, roll back on your shoulders. Exhale, roll up, try to balance, shoulders down. Inhale, in through your nose. Exhale, roll up. Balance right behind your sit bones. Two more times. Inhale, roll back on your shoulders. Exhale, roll up. One last time. Inhale, roll back on your shoulders. Balance. Exhale, roll up. Drop your feet back down. Roll all the way down for single leg stretch, crisscross, scissors, and double leg stretch. So these four exercises are kind of the ab bang, what you've been waiting for. Knees to tabletop. Hands on the outsides of the legs. Abs are pulled in for single leg stretch. Inhale, prepare. As you exhale, roll your shoulders up, reach your arms down your legs. Inhale, stay here, scoop. Exhale, reach one leg out. The leg is about 45 degrees, pulling one knee in towards your shoulder. Inhale, knees come to tabletop. Switch legs. Exhale, one leg comes in, one leg goes up. Abs are flat, scooping. Lift your tailbone, legs are parallel. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, reach out. Pull the knee toward the shoulder. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, reach out, reaching through your toes, shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, together, two more times. Exhale, reach out, shoulder blades stay up the whole time. Inhale, knees together. Exhale, reach that leg out away from your body. Inhale, knees together, and exhale, roll your shoulders down. Lace your fingers just loosely for crisscross. Leg back onto your fingertips. Elbows, you can see them out of the corners of your eyes. Rib cage is closed. Here is a variation. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, roll yourself up. Inhale, stay here. Scoop, flatten your abdominals. Exhale, rotate your, sh your shoulders, your chest toward me. Now, reach one elbow toward the floor, the other elbow toward the ceiling. Inhale, come up to center, scoop deeper. Exhale, rotate the other direction. One elbow goes down, one elbow goes up. Inhale, rotate back up to center rather than down. Stay up. Exhale, twist again, reach one elbow back, and look at your elbow. Sit, again, reach the other elbow up toward the ceiling, inhale up to center, one more time to that. Exhale, twist, squeeze your knees together tighter, make sure there's weight on both hips, inhale, come to center, and roll your shoulders down. Now, we didn't have the legs for that, but we will now. Make sure the hips stay square. Lace your fingers loosely, hands behind your head. Inhale, scoop. Exhale, roll your shoulders up. Inhale, stay right here. Exhale, rotate toward the front of the room and reach the leg to the back of the room away from you. 45 degrees, lift your tailbone, pull your knee towards your shoulder, everything stays square. Inhale, back to center, shoulders are up. Exhale, rotate the other way. Reach your elbow toward the floor, the other leg reaches away from you. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, rotate. Good, so as you're rotating, the opposite leg is reaching toward the wall in front of you. Inhale, back to center, one more time. Exhale, twist, look at your elbow scooping. Inhale, lift your shoulder a little bit higher, and exhale, roll your shoulders down to the floor. A little bit tough. 
Get ready. Scissors. Hands on the outsides of your legs. Inhale, scoop. Shoulders away from the ears. As you exhale, tuck your chin, roll up, reach one leg up to the ceiling, reach one leg out to 45 degrees. Now without the pulse, inhale, switch legs, exhale, hold. Look at your belly, look at your abdominals. Inhale, switch, exhale, shoulders away from the ears, but the shoulder blades remain up. Inhale, switch, exhale, flatten your abdominals. Keep that bottom leg nice and long and tight. Inhale, switch, exhale, shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, switch, exhale, shoulders down. Last two, inhale and exhale, just a little pull on that top leg, tighten your bottom leg. Inhale and exhale, scooping, pull the knees into the body, inhale, and roll yourself down as you exhale. Double leg stretch, coming up, hands on the outsides of your legs, and we'll do just a few variations of this. Inhale, prepare, as you exhale, roll your head up, now just the legs to start. Inhale, send your legs out, only to where you're able to maintain your scoop and your imprint, inhale, knees back in. Exhale, reach back out. Inhale, legs come in. Three more times. Exhale, flatten the abdominals. Inhale, knees come together. Two more times. Exhale, reach. Inhale, knees come right over the hips. Last one. Exhale. Inhale, pull back in and roll yourself down as you exhale. Now let's add on the upper body for this. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, roll your shoulders up. Inhale, reach your arms to the ceiling. Keep the shoulders up. Exhale, circle your arms around. Inhale, arms to the ceiling. Exhale, circle around. Inhale, arms to the ceiling. Exhale, circle around. Two more times. Inhale, arms to the ceiling. Look at your body. Exhale, circle. Last one. Inhale up. Exhale, circle. Stay here in a once. And roll your shoulders down as you exhale. Can we put all that together? Only five reps. Shoulder blades stay up the entire time, and you're looking at your legs. Here we go. Inhale. Exhale. Roll your shoulders up. Inhale, arms and legs reach up. Exhale, circle around. Inhale, reach up, keep your scoop, look at your body. Exhale, circle. Inhale, arms up, so your arms and legs counterbalance each other. Exhale, two more times. Inhale, exhale, last one. Inhale, flatten your abdominals. Exhale, circle. Stay your inhale once. And exhale, roll yourself back down to the floor. Nice work. All right, drop the feet back down to the floor. Let's do just a little bit of a bridge to open the hips back up from all that hip flexor work we did. So inhale, prepare. As you exhale, roll yourself up, just like we did in the warm-up. Open the hips just a little bit. Inhale, stay right here. Activate the glutes. Spread your toes out. Exhale, roll yourself back down the floor. Let's do it again. Inhale, scoop. Exhale, roll your hips up. Open the hip flexors. Feel the glutes and the hamstrings engaging. Reach the fingers toward the heels. Exhale, roll back down the floor. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, bottom. Exhale, roll your hips up, 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 up. Squeezing your butt, spread your toes out, chin is tucked. Arms are long. Inhale, stay. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. Now, let's roll over for a little breast stroke to get the middle back muscles. So, no workout would be complete without doing just a little bit of middle back work. So, feet together. Or legs together on the floor. Start with your hands next to your body. Inhale, prepare. Shoulders move away from the ears as you exhale. Inhale, lift your chest, your shoulders away from the floor, engaging your middle back. Toes remain on the floor. Abs are still scooped. Pelvis is pressed down. Exhale, lower your hands to the floor. So your arms and your shoulders move as one unit. Inhale, lift up as you lift up. Squeeze your elbows into your body. Pull the shoulders away from the ears. Still looking at the floor. Feel your middle back more than your lower back. Exhale, lower your shoulders. Lower your head to the floor. Or lower your chest to the floor. Again, inhale, lift up. Squeezing your elbows into the body. Press the pelvis down. Keep the toes pressed into the floor. Exhale, lower your chest. Two more times. Inhale, lift, 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 scoop. Exhale, lower your hands. And one more time. Inhale, lift up. Lengthen your neck. Still looking at the floor, but looking out at the front of the mat. Exhale, lower your chest, lower your body. Let's add a bar to that. Inhale, lift up. Same position you were a moment ago. As you exhale, reach your arms across the floor, lower your chest. As you reach, make sure the shoulders stay away from the ears. Turn your palms out. Inhale, circle your arms all the way in. Squeezing your arms in tightly to your body. Your toes remain down. Bend your elbows. Exhale, reach your arms out. Inhale, lift your chest. Squeeze the shoulders away from the ears. Bend your elbows. Exhale, lower, reach the arms out again, fingers together. 
Inhale, circle the arms around big into the body. Two more times. Bend your elbows. Exhale, lower your chest. Inhale, big circle, engaging your middle back muscles, all of those postural muscles. Bend your elbows. Exhale, lower. Inhale, lift your body up. Reach your fingers towards your ankles. Bend your elbows and lower your chest as you exhale. Curl your toes under. Lift yourself up. Bring your knees underneath you. And bring your hips back into a shell stretch. We call this shell stretch in Pilates. Drop your head down. Almost the top of your head comes down. Fingers and arms will reach back behind the body. As you pull up, as we press our sit bones toward our heels to stretch our lower back and our middle back just a little tiny bit. Keep breathing into your back, so breathing in through the nose, scooping and exhaling, deepening the scoop as we exhale through the mouth. We do that about five times. Breathing into the back, keeping the abs pulled in. And one more big breath into your back. And exhale, reach the fingers once again away from your ears and press your sit bones down toward your heels. Roll yourself up and let's move on. All right, so moving on to spine stretch. Little spine stretch forward. Feet about neck width apart, slightly wider, sit right on top of your sit bones. Hands on the floor, chest is lifted. Inhale, grow taller. Pinch your sit bones together. Exhale. Tuck your chin, so roll from your head into your shoulders, down into your rib cage, rolling down, stretching all those muscles through your back. Now make sure your weight stays on your sit bones. Inhale, scoop, and roll yourself all the way back up, lengthening your spine. Exhale, tuck your chin, roll down one vertebrae at a time, head all the way into your lumbar spine. Pull your abs into your spine. Inhale, grow taller, so as tall as you can. Three more times. Exhale, roll down, reach through your fingertips, Shoulders remain down away from the ears, abs are pulled in, weight on the sit bones. Inhale, sit up as tall as you can, scooping, lengthening. Two more times, tuck your chin. Exhale, round your back, roll down, one vertebrae. Pull your abs into your spine just a little bit more. Inhale, sit up as tall as you can, grow taller. Last one, exhale, roll down, one vertebrae at a time, deepening the scoop. Stay here, inhale once into your back, and exhale, roll yourself all the way up. Moving on. Roll all the way back down for a teaser. So let's do some teaser variations. Knees at tabletop. Arms reach over the head. Thumbs reaching toward the floor. Make sure the rib cage stays down. So if we lower our arms so much that the rib cage lifts up, we've lost the opening engagement. So arms only reach back as far as we're able to keep the ribs connected to the hips. Inhale, raise your arms to the seat. Chin is tucked. Exhale, tuck your chin, roll your spine one vertebrae at a time, and as you come to the top, try to sit as tall as you can. Inhale, raise your arms up to the ceiling, scooping. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time, and reach the arms back behind you. Keep your ribs connected and keep scooped. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, tuck your chin, roll yourself up one vertebrae at a time. Inhale, raise your arms up, maintain your scoop, shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. Let's add on just a little bit more challenge. Your choice. Inhale, arms up. Exhale. Roll yourself up one more time. And as you inhale, you raise your arms. Extend the legs if you're able to get your thoracic spine extended at the same time. A little bit of a balance challenge here. Exhale, roll down one more time. Bend the knees and reach the arms back behind you. Let's try that again. Inhale, arms to the ceiling. Exhale, roll yourself up one more time. time. Inhale, raise your arms and your legs at the same time. If you're able to keep your spine nice and long, squeeze your legs together, scooping deeper. Exhale, roll down. One vertebrae at a time. Bend your knees as you come down. Let's do that two more times. Inhale, arms up. And this is as challenging as it's going to get. Roll yourself up as you exhale. Inhale, raise your arms to the ceiling. Think of floating your arms and your legs up. Chin is tucked. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time. Lower your back first, then bend your knees and like, raise your arms or lower your arms behind you. Last one. Inhale, arms. Exhale, lift your head, scooping as you roll up. As you inhale, raise your arms and your legs. Floating your arms and your legs up, scooping. Chin is up. Scoop deeper. Exhale, roll down one vertebrae at a time and reach your arms back behind you. Nice work. Roll yourself all the way up. Roll over for a little bit of plank work. So lie on your belly. 
Open your arms up to a position, the position of a number 11. Inner thighs are connected. Curl your toes under. Push the floor away from you. And pull your abdominals up away from the floor first. So your tailbone is slightly tilted under. Abs are pulled up, shoulders away from the ears. Palms can be down or palms can face each other. Good. As you inhale, straighten your legs. Form a straight line from your head to your hips all the way to your heels. And exhale, lower your knees back to the floor. Inhale, lift your knees up. Press back into your heels just a little bit. Push your weight back, scooping deeper. Exhale, lower your knees. Inhale, lengthen out the backs of your knees. Squeeze your inner thighs together. Engage your glutes and lower your knees as you exhale. Two more times. Inhale, lift. Push the floor away from you. Inner thighs together. Exhale, lower. One more time. Inhale, lift. Squeeze, scoop. Look in front of your fingertips. Lower your knees as you exhale. Now for more challenge, we're coming up to the hands. For a little more stability in the shoulder, a little more, a little more challenge with stabilizing the shoulders. So hands directly under your shoulders. Extend one leg, extend the other leg. Once again, forming that straight line from your head to your shoulders, to your hips, all the way to your hands. This time, inhale, scoop. As you exhale, press your weight back into your heels. Just a weight shift. Inhale, point your feet, shift forward, scoop. Exhale, press back. That's it, feel your ankles, feel your calves stretching, engaging your abdominals. Press forward as you inhale. Exhale, press back. Keep your eyes forward in front of, keep your gaze in front of your fingers. Press forward as you inhale. Exhale, press back. Push the floor away from you. Inhale, press forward. One more time. Exhale, press back. Inhale, press forward. And exhale, lower your knees to the floor. Shake out your wrists just a little tiny bit. I know on the mat sometimes they can become a little, they can become a little bit uncomfortable. Hands directly underneath your shoulders for a calf stretch. Start with an inhale, lengthen your spine. As you exhale, tuck your tailbone, tailbone to head. Look up at your navel. Inhale, lift your head first. And then extend your spine from your head all the way to your tail, still maintaining control and still keeping the rib cage closed. Exhale, tailbone to head. So rounding your back, flexing your spine. Look up at your navel. Push the floor away from you. Inhale, lift your head first, extending from your neck all the way into your middle spine and into your lumbar spine. So keeping your scoop and keeping the rib cage connected. Let's do that three more times. Exhale, flex your spine. Pull your abs up, push the floor away from you, look up at your navel. Relax your ankles. Inhale, lift your head. Extending through your middle spine and your lumbar spine. Tailbone comes up, abs are still scoop. Pull the shoulders away from the ears. Two more times, tailbone under, flex. So exhale, 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 pull up through your abdominals. Relax the glutes if possible. Inhale, lift your head, extending through your spine. Lengthening, pulling the abs up. One last time, exhale, tailbone under. Tailbone under, pull up, pull up through your abdominals. Inhale, extending, looking just a little bit in front of you. Shoulders away from the ears, ribs closed and scoot. And then exhale, come back to your neutral position where your spine is parallel with the floor. Shake out your wrists. Lie all the way on your belly. Toes down. Reach around one foot. Push that foot into your hand. So just a modification for rocking. Push your foot into your hand until you feel your quadricep muscle engage. Other hand comes out. Go ahead. Press your foot into your hand until it pulls your chest just a little bit away from the floor. Engaging the glute, engaging the quad, opening the chest, opening the front of the body, and lower back down as you exhale. Switch sides. Other hand. Press your hand into your foot. Inhale, lift up just a little side. Then by pressing, by using your quadricep muscle, Press your pelvis down, looking in front of you, inhale. Exhale, lower all the way back down. Hands in front of you, swimming variations. So a little bit of swimming for your middle and lower back. As we inhale, lift your right hand and your left foot off the floor, left leg. So the left leg is straight, right arm has a slight bend. You're looking out in front of your mat, pelvis stays down and square on the floor. Exhale, lower back down. Other side. Inhale, lift your left arm and your right leg. Notice how my right leg is straight, reaching through the toe, the left arm stays slightly bent. Exhale, lower back down. This is all we're doing. Inhale, lift your arm and lift your leg. Opposite, oppositional movement. Exhale, lower back down. Three more times. Inhale, lift your left arm and your right leg. Keep reaching through that right leg. Pelvis is square. Lower back down as you exhale. 
Keep the scoop two more times. Inhale, lift, shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, lower back down. And one more time. Inhale, lift up, reach through your toes. After, again, pulled up, hips are pressed into the floor. Lower back down as you exhale. And roll yourself all the way back up. So, last piece is just some lateral stretching. Hands on the floor. Reach your arm to the ceiling as you inhale. Exhale, bend to one side. And as you bend to that side, Press weight into the opposite sit bone. So you feel the stretch all through your lats, all the way into your obliques, your quadriceps, and warm your lower back. Inhale, raise your arm back up to the ceiling. Exhale, lower. Other side, inhale, raise your arm up. Exhale, bend. Press all of your weight into that sit bone, the opposite side. Inhale, raise your arm up. Exhale, lower back down. Let's try that again. Inhale, raise your arm to the ceiling. Shoulder down. Exhale, bend. Press weight into the opposite sit bone. Soften your other elbow underneath you. Inhale, raise your arm up. Exhale. Last one. Inhale, raise your arm up. Keep your scoop. Exhale, bend sideways. Shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, raise your arm back up. And exhale, lower your arm. Thank you for joining me for Pilates today.